One of the most common misconceptions about cardio is that it's designed for fat people. No, it's not designed for fat people. It's not designed for those that's trying to lose fat either. It's actually here to make sure we get our cardiovascular system up to par and maintain that. The cardiovascular system is so important. It makes sure the body circulates what the body needs the most, nutrients and oxygen. That's the system by way which all things move throughout your body. Make sure it's efficient. Regular bits of cardio, 30 minutes to 60 minutes, three and for some five times a week. It depends on how aggressive your goals are, but make sure you get a dose of cardiovascular health every week. The second key to success is strength training, somehow creating resistance to the muscles. But contrary to popular belief, it's not for big hulking guys like myself or for females who want really massive muscles. The skeletal system is innervated by the muscles, musculoskeletal system. For just general health, I don't care if you're geriatric, pediatric, or middle age, we all should pay attention to our musculoskeletal system. So we should all get at least two to three days of strength training involved every week. Overall wellness is the goal here. The third key to success you'll always hear me preach is recovery. Recovery is actually in two parts though. That's your sleeping and your fuel. Your fuel is how you're going to restore yourself from doing number one, cardio, and number two, strength training. But make sure you give yourself high quality fuel. That means fuel that actually has good bang for every calorie that you're eating. Macronutrients, carb, protein, and fat. And also make sure you're getting your sleep. That way your body can recover from all that you're doing. Cardio, strength training, and recovery. This is overall health and wellness, you guys. I promise you I can help you with it even more. Big Ron Jones with Real Advice for Real Goals.